Hey y'all, welcome back to My Real California Life. I just realized the door's open. Hold on. Come on, Marley Mae. Come on. That's what happens when you don't edit your videos, huh? Sorry about that, guys. Oop. So, hi, how are you? Oh my gosh, it is Saturday. I hope you are all having an amazing day, you guys. First of all, I was so happy that it was Saturday. Okay, I'll tell you. First of all, before I get into it, if you're new here, I'm Sandra. Thank you so much for coming to check out my channel. You are already here, so I really hope that you would hit that subscribe button and hit the bell right next to it. That way you get notified whenever I upload a video, which is typically often. I normally try to do it a few times a week. Um, obviously, if you don't know, my leg is broken or my foot is broken, so it has been a little bit harder, but... I am trying. I'm trying to get to a thousand subscribers before my cast comes off. However, we are down to three days. So I'd have to really, I mean, we'd have to really get working to get it up there, but we could do it. So if everybody shares, tells everybody, go hit that subscribe button. I mean, I have more views coming in on my videos. So if everybody hit that subscribe button, we could get there. But I do go back on Tuesday. Um, and this cast will come off for sure, but I will, they will decide at that time if I'm going to have to have surgery or not, um, if the bone is healed, because if you have not been here, I will tell you real quick, um, it, I had what's called a spiral break, so the bones twisted, um, and so they don't know if it's going to come together and heal properly, so we'll just have to wait and see. Okay, hold on. I want to show you guys though, because super duper cute. Man, I don't know. That might be kind of hard. Look at this. I painted my nails last night. I'm super horrible at painting them. But if you've been here, I said I was going to try to do red and green. I thought I had green, but I didn't. So I had this really pretty like red glittery. And then what I did, I had this really pretty gold. It's hard to see, but it's like a gold glitter and it has a little bit of red in it too. So what I did was I just did like a one undercoat of like this dark charcoal gray blackish color I have and then did the gold over it. And then um, I did the same on my toes. Look, that little one I did is the black with the gold. Oh, how cute. So cute. It's so hard to paint your toes like when your foot's broken. They look horrible. But, I mean, seriously, I think that's like the cutest I've ever done my toes. But look, it's all like underneath and stuff. I have to go fix them. But they match. How cute. Okay, you guys. So I'll tell you though, I was having a really good day. Especially because the mail came. And then I went outside to take some garbage, which my husband got mad and was like, what are you doing? I can take the garbage. Anyways, I went over and there was a dead bird, which super made me sad because it sucks. Um, on our second floor, like coming off of the bedrooms, um, there's like a outside deck kind of. So on that one wall, there is like windows. It's like plexiglass windows to create like a, so there's not so much of an air coming through and um sometimes the birds run into them and it really sucks um because you know they run into it and then just fall and I'm assuming that that's what happened that's the second time we've had it since we've been here and we've been here oh we've been here a year now on December 8th was a year but um I know that that's what happened so if anybody has tips for that or a way that you know to help I would really like to but First of all, oh my gosh, I'm going to open this first now. Okay. If you guys have been here, you know that I said my husband ordered me an amazing custom highlighter from, I mean, it's not a custom high. I mean, I guess, okay. It's a highlighter that this amazing indie company makes the lady who owns the company and who makes it, her name is red. Now, the thing is, though, she makes everything by hand once it's ordered. So it's not like I just went to the store, just ordered, you know. So actually, the one that she made me, and I've been telling you guys, it's coming, it's coming. It was supposed to be here so long ago. It got lost in the mail. Like, it is still lost. I'll tell you, y'all. They still keep sending me text messages. I'm actually going to go down there and try to find out what's going on because... They sent, first it kept going back and forth because I was tracking it and I kept getting text messages saying that it was going from San Jose to Salinas and I don't know why they kept doing that. So now I keep getting a text that says processing exemption, San Jose distributing center. So I looked up online what that means and it means that for some reason they can't deliver it either that the address isn't 
findable, which I get all my other mail, so what's the issue? Or the package is damaged. Now, I think that the package is damaged and they aren't delivering it. So, you guys, this is a highlighter. And I have been telling you guys, and I said I didn't want to say the name because I didn't want to tell you guys before I had the product. Okay, the company is called A Devil's Kiss. Now, she doesn't have, like, an online store. You have to go to Instagram, and I will link her Instagram in my description. And then um, you can look through. She has so much stuff on there, and then you just DM her. Or if there's something you're looking for, like, she'll make colors. She's so cool. Sorry, I didn't mean to bump that. But, so, yes, it's called, uh, like, like the letter A, Devil's Kiss. And I am so excited, you guys, because this freaking highlighter is gorgeous. I mean, I don't know, but it looks gorgeous. You know, I'm sure it is. So, I like the bag, too. Like, how cute is that bag with roses and lipstick? Okay, you guys. Now, it looks like there's a little something that's not, that's separate. So, I'm like, okay. And I know she was like, she felt so bad that it got lost. And I was like, oh, honey, it's not your fault. I know it's not your fault. Because she was like... I'll refund you. And I was like, no, I don't want my money back. I want the highlighter. I need that highlighter. Forrest, Leroy, I know that's you. Why do you bang it? Sorry, you guys. Hold on one second. Oh, my goodness. I'm so sorry, you guys. And all it was was uh, Minecraft updates just to let everybody know in case you were wondering. So, okay. So, yeah, she felt super bad. that. Oh, my gosh. I just opened up the package while I was... Oh, my gosh. Okay. She felt super bad that it had not come... And I was like, no, 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 I just, I really want the highlighter. And she's like, I'll remake it, get out. So I was like, okay, that's fine. I don't care if it takes longer. Do what you, I just really want the makeup. Oh, yes. Oh, hold on one second, you guys. Okay, I'm so sorry about that, you guys. He had wanted tater tots. I forgot I turned on the oven. And I didn't put them in. So, okay, yes. Yeah, so she felt super bad. And so she's making new stuff all the time. Obviously, I follow her on Instagram. And I saw the other day, actually, she had made this amazing color. And my favorite color is purple. And she knows that. And look at what she included. Oh, my gosh. Like, and her stuff is amazing. I see the pictures and I am just like, okay, so it's called Alice in Psycholand. Ooh, you know what's really cool is it's purple. But I can see in it, it's got like a red glitter. It is amazing. And if you're wondering, um, I went ahead and decided to go ahead and use the ColourPop foundation again today and try it. If you didn't see the other day, I got a ColourPop order and the foundation I got was super light. Um, so I tried mixing it with this one I have. It's a little bit dark. And doing it, I did my normal Ipanema like I do, my normal brush. And I still just felt, it was really weird. Like, no matter what I did, the it kept moving. The foundation kept moving around and the, it kept being like streaky and it's never like that with the BH. So I don't know, maybe I just don't like the color pop. Maybe somebody has tips. Maybe I should do that one with the sponge rather than a brush. Um, I actually did just get a new Ofra sponge. So maybe I'll try that and just see, I don't know, but oh my gosh. Okay. I have to figure out how to get in here without ruining this. Okay, here we go. I like how she has it against a red glitter background, too. That's super pretty. Like, oh, my gosh. And I just got my Z palette. Yeah. Okay. You guys, it's C, but she had it against the background. It is. It smells amazing. Oh, my goodness. I smelled something that was like candy. And I was like, what is that smell? For sure, it's not this eyeshadow. And it was, or I don't know. I'm assuming it's eyeshadow. But you guys. I don't even want to touch it. It's so pretty. Okay. Red, I hope you watch this and I hope you subscribe to my channel and you're freaking amazing. Oh my gosh. <gasps> you guys, it is so pretty. And I seriously, I know I like that, but I was like barely even touching it. Okay. Oh my gosh. That is so beautiful, and it's totally that grapey purple that I love, that, like, iridescent, really pretty, almost has, like, a splash of pink purple, you know, not, like, that dark blue-based purple. Like, I really like this purple. <gasps> 
so pretty red you're flipping awesome and i know you guys can't see but it's got like sparks of red glitter here and there and i don't know see right there you can totally see that was like perfect lighting do you see that <gasps> that's so amazing okay i am telling you go check her out i will leave a link in the description but it's a devil's kiss wait until you guys see this highlighter i don't know if this pan is oh it is magnetic Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Okay. I have a couple more of these little shadows coming from um Touch of Glam Beauty, which is um I ordered my husband ordered me a custom highlighter from them. So here is the star of the show though. I mean not that that I need to save this stuff for my giveaway because you guys were having a huge giveaway soon. So make sure you're subscribed. We're gonna open this boxy charm because you guys my boxy looks came. That's amazing. Yes, but I'm going to open that highlighter because I'm pretty sure that there's no highlighter. Well, unless I got that Wander palette, um, which I'm really hoping I get the powder instead. But if I did get that Wander palette, I still probably am not going to use it. So we're going to check out the Boxy Lux also in just a second. But let's check this out too. How do we open this? Let's see. Do I might have to cut it? Yep. I think so. Okay, you guys. So... I don't know how to say it. This highlighter is called Semane. 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 I don't know how to say it. Basically, it means the end of summer, going into fall and winter. It's that time. So. Oh, so cute. I love that. Oh, man, that sticker is so cute. Oh, it's like, it's a see-through sticker, too, but it's on the black um, tissue paper. So, that's cute. Okay. You guys, I am just, I don't even know. <gasps> you guys are going to just die. Oh my gosh. I have to get my highlighting brush right now. Oh my gosh, you guys. Okay. So another one of those stickers on the back, but just wait because she does, like I said, everything is done custom by hand. So that means the packaging also. And yes, this is just a single compact highlighter, but you guys, are you kidding me right now? Okay, Katie from Tattooed Mama. She's a channel I watch. I love her. You hear me talk about her all the time. She loves skulls. Katie, you have got to go check out this company. Look at this case. Oh my gosh. And she did this. This is all like raised. Look at, oh my gosh. Beautiful. Okay, now wait till you see this highlighter. Now I saw this. And honestly, I wouldn't think that this would be normally the first thing I'm drawn to because I hate bugs. I hate spiders. But something about this palette, or I mean this palette, this compact, I loved. Instantly, I was like, I have got to have that. Okay, you guys just wait. She actually, that's so cute. There's a little puffy in it with the little plastic. It smells amazing. There's a nice big mirror, but I don't want to blind you guys. Oh my gosh, you guys. Okay. Look at that highlighter. Do you see that? It is gorgeous. Like, it's so hard for you guys to see in the camera. But I mean, there is so many different colors. And this spider in the middle is like a burgundy, just beautiful, beautiful burnt brick color oh my gosh it's just so pretty isn't that gorgeous she's amazing you guys okay now the thing is is i don't even want to oh it's nice i don't want to touch the spider though you know i'm like Ooh. i just barely even touched it look at that oh my gosh okay let's see whoa okay the colors like I don't know what I was expecting it's beautiful now I'm not saying it like that but it's like I don't even know how to explain it's like a a peachy orange pink purple like okay do you see it's gonna be hard I just put a little bit I mean obviously you can see see it's right there next but you can see right there is like that pink peachy, but oh my gosh, you guys, it's flipping gorgeous. Seriously, there's so many colors in this that it's just, it's amazing. Okay. Oh, duh, there's a mirror on it. Hello. 
that is seriously so flipping pretty. Look at that. I know it's like, you guys, that light's not going to even do it like justice because, oh my goodness gracious. But I can see it's more of almost like, oh, there you go. Now the light got it right there. Look at that. And I was going to say it's more of like a glitter, but it is definitely, you know, that highlighter. This light's just not even doing it. Oh my gosh. It's so beautiful though. Especially, I guess if somebody, if you, I would say if you like more of like, uh, gosh, I don't even know how to explain it. It's so gorgeous. You just got to kind of like, I guess, see it for yourself because it's flipping amazing and it's like you turn and you'll catch the light and it's like a twinkle of glitter like oh it's beautiful you guys I flipping love it and I'm definitely not even gonna swatch that um that spider in the middle though that is like too gorgeous too oh my god it's so pretty okay red you're amazing I have been waiting for this I'm gonna have to do a look with that purple eyeshadow though and we'll do a whole thing isn't that flipping awesome oh my gosh I just cannot get over this this is so freaking gorgeous oh my gosh oh my gosh now I gotta find that other one if I ever do get that one that's lost in transit man she did say she was like if you ever do get that other one at least you can have it and you can do it for a giveaway and I was like or I could keep it so I have two of them <laughs> I'm just kidding. If I do get the other one, I probably will do it for a giveaway. So that will be super duper awesome. But go check out Red at A Devil's Kiss. I mean, are you kidding me? This and that amazing purple eyeshadow that she sent me. There's the swatch. And just look at the highlighter. See? Oh my gosh. And that was just a little bit like, hmm, look at that. So pretty. Okay. Now... Okay. Let's get on. I honestly, I was thinking like, um, I was going to open. Yeah, you know what? We'll open the boxy charm. We can get through it. I don't need to take that terribly long, huh? There's our huge thing. And we all know everyone's seen it. It's tis the sea sun instead of like season. It's like sea and sun. But I did see somebody else was like, what the heck? And I do agree that font is kind of looking at it. Honestly, it first looks like it says sea gun. That S totally looks like a G. So not maybe the best font, but hey, I'm not going to complain about it. I know that thing's in there because of the battery pack and the makeup bag. So the first thing I have right off the bat is the mini straightener. And I know it came in a whole bunch of different colors. And it looks like my writing's blue. So I know mine's going to be blue from what I've seen. And I am happy with that. I don't mind. I was hoping, obviously, for a purple because that's my favorite color. But that doesn't matter. So this is awesome. And I do not have a straightener. I do not have anything. I've never done anything to my hair um, other than what the person has done at the salon, like when I get it cut, but wow, this thing is tiny, tiny, tiny. I was really expecting it to be bigger. Like seriously, look at that. It's the size of my hand, like not even, it's a little bit shorter, which is super crazy. I mean, I don't have long hair anymore, so I thought it would be okay if I wanted to try it, but that is really small, especially since I think they say it's worth like $85 or something. $75. Let's see. Spongily Elmas Wanderbush. Hi, Bob. Mini hair straightener. $75 is the MSRP. So that is crazy. Hi, I do want to try it though, so that's good. Huh. I'm sorry. I was rolling out the door and I slammed. Oh, it's okay. Banged. Okay. I was trying to get it here and Merle. I was like, I got it, Merle. Okay, shut it, baby. Sorry, you guys. Okay. So let's see. Next. Ooh, I have the sponge gel. And it's um, an exfoliating sponge, like already enriched with soap, which is super awesome. It does say it's MSRP for 20 so stop it for us now. Sorry, you guys. So, and they do come in all different smells. And again, this one's Blossom Bliss. You can feel it's really heavy, like, oh my gosh, it smells amazing. And you see it looks like a shark. Bye. Shark? Are you kidding me? Does that look like a shark? That looks like a star. Oh my goodness gracious. Wow. Holy cow. Okay, so I'm happy about that. I'm going to definitely use it. I like that, and I like body washes. Okay, so 
On to the next. Oh my gosh, I cannot keep that thing on my lap for the life of me. So we're going to move it. That's what I was talking about. Um, That paper, because this is a battery pack. It is actually like a little traveling makeup bag. And you know what? I'm going to... Sorry, you guys, but the door is still open just a little bit. Hey, Marta May, you can go out here too. Come on, let's go. Go with your dad. Thank you. Okay. Sorry, don't mind me, guys. I know I'm like look like a ragamuffin okay so this is a little bag it says glam af it's like a faux leather oh it's a little you know so you can like put it around your wrist take it out and i know there's supposed to be a charger inside so i do not have one of these and this is from crimes of beauty let's see so $22 is what this is the MSRP and so it tells you all the stuff so basically you charge this and then you keep it and then you can um, charge your phone with this you know and it can do Android or our iPhone which is nice um, I did however see a couple people saying on their unboxing videos to be careful not to have it near fabric or not to fall asleep because some people were saying that theirs were sparking and stuff so I don't know I can't confirm that and I'm not saying like oh my gosh they're horrible I am just saying watch out just you know I wouldn't ever put something like this near fabric or do it when you fall asleep so just I'm repeating what I have seen on to the next. I did get the Wander Beauty. Okay, not going to complain. Um, Wander Beauty Dust to Dawn Blush and Highlighting Pouted. 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 It's about it. I'm going to pout about it. No, a powder. And it retails for $26. Now, we have been getting a lot of Wander Beauty. I feel like in all the subscriptions, like I've gotten... Um, what did I get? The mascara, Wild Gone Boxy Charm. I got a little like lotion that's okay um, in one of my other ones. And then we got the under eye mask. So I haven't tried anything like. Oh, hold on, you guys, one second. Okay, my goodness. My little one is just. Whew, he's overtired. He slept in his own room for the very first time last night. And he made it until about four this morning. But he's overtired okay so these are we have you know there's a little mirror and then you have three of these long pans it looks like we have okay Tuscan sunrise Habana nights and city lights so you know what? I don't even know if I'm gonna actually I feel like they're really like these pans are really weird to um you know because it's like oh maybe I didn't need to do that or mm, I can just go totally overboard holy but Jesus why do I always do that always always I like the kicked in the face look apparently <laughs> oh shoot now I gotta make this one match huh and the thing is it's like I'm so pale I just drowned out all my highlighter too, so I need to put on more highlighter, but not bad. I mean, obviously I went way overboard, but it is a really pretty color. I like it. I mean, maybe I might as well. I know, like I said, I already have highlighter on. You can actually still see that, so it's going to be kind of hard to do this one too, but I do want to kind of see this, see how it is, because I've never done a wander, you know, highlighter. So let's just see. Mm, you know, I'm actually going to do it like underneath. Okay, I was just trying to see if it was going to do, like, even, like, mm, I just thought, I was going to say, it kind of seems like it's more of, like, a bronzer. Don't even ask me what I was thinking, putting it underneath. But, like, maybe that's for me. Maybe it's just too dark Um, because I'm just really pale, like I said. You know, okay, I feel like I didn't put as much highlight on that side, so maybe we'll. Hmm. It's like over here, like how I did right there. It looks a little bit more like bronzer. Oh my gosh, I feel like I'm getting powder in my nose. So let's just see. Because I feel like for me, it's kind of, yeah. 
it's just kind of dark for my skin like that see that's it right there at the bottom right here so it might be cute for like an eyeshadow and stuff though but it is a little dark um now i've touched all over it but maybe who knows maybe i will give it to i don't know we'll see that's another cute thing though i would have preferred the powder but it's okay it is okay did that even i don't even think that was in there no that was the straightener huh oh well on to the next this is craziness okay you guys so this is the um elemis pro collagen marine cream anti-wrinkle day cream you guys okay this retails for 89 dollars. i love this box are you kidding me i love like, I would never spend this. I don't even know what kind of good face products. But honestly, I will tell you, I'm 36. I just turned 36. I wish I would have started taking care of my skin a long time ago rather than starting now. So women, girls, guys, even if you're young, start doing it before. Stay on top of it. It'll be better. What? Oh, my timer. Hold on one second. My tater dots. Oh my goodness gracious, I am so sorry. This is like I've been doing a million things. I will do another video, I promise, where I'm actually going to do a look. And I want to use my... I was going to do the Zulu palette. But I'm kind of thinking about using this other one that's coming. I don't know, we're going to do another look. Because we still got some other stuff to unbag too. So this is crazy though. Oh my gosh. And you guys, actually I saw some people were getting um, one in their... Ipsy Glam Bag Plus, which is their new full-size products one, and I will be getting that. Um, I don't know what five products I'm getting yet, but I saw some people were getting this stuff for their face that's like a collagen or vitamin C or something, and it retails for $180. So I hope I get that. But Okay, next I have, ooh, I got the Grande Mascara. Now this is from Lorac. I have never tried this, so I am super happy. Now, see, we're going to definitely have to do, okay, Luxie Tarte. Okay, oh, no, I saw, I'm sorry, it's not. Okay, I saw that they were doing Lorac. Mine is actually from Grande Cosmetics. Again, I have not tried, which is super awesome. Now, it says get extreme length and volume while promoting healthier lashes with this new Grande Mascara infused with lash-loving blends of peptids, Okay, yeah, a bunch of stuff. It's buildable, water resistant, it's easily removable to prevent lash breakage while keeping the lashes flexible and strong. Their boxy tip says curl your lashes before applying mascara to give your lashes extra length and volume. Really? Really? Like, even me, who I'm completely new to makeup, even I know that. Like, that's not... <laughs> Sorry, that's so funny. Okay. So, I'm assuming it's the color black. I didn't even look, but yep. Okay. I don't know why it's just normal, but it's just a normal straight wand. I am super excited, though, because if it retails for $25, it's got to be good mascara. And there it is. So, again, I dropped this. Let's see what else we got. Now, let's see. We got our Tarte. Everybody got this. The Tartiste um glitter lip paint and i think there's like three different colors looks like i got insta famous i don't know which one that is but this one um msrp 20 their tip is use a lippy alone or over your favorite lipstick to give it some sparkly dimension i did see some people were saying that got like the gold color it was kind of more of like a glitter topper or if you like like a more sheer gloss it's perfect but let's see what color we got oh okay this is beautiful it's like a pinky really light pinky with like a really it's like a pinky peach nude but it's got that really pretty iridescent glitter that's like that pink purple blue green so this is really cute let's see okay i see what people mean though that like i saw people oh my gosh it smells amazing like butterscotch or I don't know. But people are saying that like much wasn't coming out and I can see it's like, but yeah, it is pretty like it is sheer, you know, but it is definitely pretty glossy, you know, so when I don't have any tart lip gloss, so that's always cool now. Oh my gosh. 
Luxie brushes, y'all. And sorry, I have to tell you, I'm so flipping excited because I have these three from the same set that I got from BoxyCharm when I first signed up. And then this one is from the exact same set that I just got from Ipsy. And now we got this. So I have like the full set. That is flipping amazing. I love it. So cool. I'm not going to open it right now, but there is eight brushes. And it looks like some of them, no, they look different than those other big ones. So that's cool. Because, um, oh, and that actually, let's see. $65. Wow. But like I said, we're going to do another video where I'm going to actually do my makeup and we will use those. And last but definitely not least, we have the Violet Voss Pro Eyeshadow. And this is the um, HG, which is the Holy Grail. And this retails for $45, y'all. And this looked so pretty. Some people got two palettes because you could have chose. We actually got to chose, choose, excuse me, this time whether we wanted a Suva palette or the hair straightener. And I just, I mean, we have so many palettes that I wanted to get the straightener because I don't have one. And I've never used one. So, I am very happy about this, though. This looks like a really nice palette. Ooh, it's all, like, hollow, you know, but super pretty. Like, the ombre going from black to burgundy or purple. So, this is super beautiful. You have shimmers and mattes, but, like, your normal basics, but also, like, beautiful berries and warm browns you know the pinks oh my gosh that is beautiful you're gonna we're gonna be able to create a whole bunch of looks with that and you have a nice big mirror so what did you guys think what'd you get in your boxy did you love it if you haven't signed up i'm telling you go sign up because yes this was the boxy lux which is 50 dollars, and this is every three months but regular boxy charm is every month 21 dollars, and you get five full-size items i mean seriously i've gotten a palette every single month since i've been with them and i've been six months now seven months now so go try them out you guys are awesome Go check out A Devil's Kiss. She is flipping amazing. I am so happy this finally came. Oh my gosh. And we will be back with another video soon doing a look. I hope you guys loved it. See you soon.